welcome back to my channel. I am Jillian Berry. In today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you one of my favorite recipes in the whole world. It is a curry recipe combined with zucchini noodles to make a raw pasta dish with a beautiful curry sauce. I highly recommend it. I got the inspiration from Fully Raw Christina. Go follow her because in my opinion, she has some of the best recipes on YouTube. I tweaked the recipe a little bit to make it more spicy because I do like spicy. So if you do as well, give this video a thumbs up right now and let's get started. Many people don't realize you can turn zucchinis into beautiful spiralized noodles and they make the most perfect base for a mock pasta dish. So they're super satisfying. And what's great is you feel so energized after eating these dishes when you, when you do the zucchini noodles with the sauce versus how you feel when it's a pasta dish and it's cooked and heavy and processed and weighs you down. In case you're not aware, I will show you how you can create the noodles. You can use a spiralizer like this or you can use a handheld spiralizer like this, which you can get at the grocery store. Another option is if you're on the go or you don't want to spiralize them, you can buy them at most grocery stores already pre-spiralized like this, which I do many times when I'm busy and they taste just as great and they're very fresh. I will show you the ingredients you need for this amazing dish right now. First of all, you need your zucchinis as the base. I would use two to six zucchinis, depending how big you want to make your dishes or if it's for other people or not. We will also have cherry tomatoes, these beautiful cherry tomatoes, sesame seeds, some raw sesame seeds. We have peeled navel oranges, have for spice, some basil, some rosemary, and some sage. We also have some turmeric in this recipe, a little bit of ginger. We have some curry powder, which I love and which makes this makes this recipe and then some cumin seed as well we will whip that together in a second and I just want to show you also for the dish what I like to cut up is some fresh pineapple to go on top of the zoodles some red onion some beautiful cherry tomatoes and then also some red pepper as well so here we go it's so easy to spiralize your noodles you just cut the ends off and start spiralizing so like I said too, if you don't have one of these, you can order one of these on Amazon, get it delivered to your house tomorrow. Here we are, we'll start with our ingredients. So we use two to three peeled navel oranges. We will use two cups of our beautiful cherry tomatoes. And then we will use about a third to a half a cup of sesame seeds. We will use one tablespoon of turmeric powder. I like to use two tablespoons of curry powder in this. We will put in a dash of cumin. For extra spice, we will put in a tiny little bit of ginger, some basil. So I have a fresh, it's always best to buy your basil fresh too. It just smells so good and it's so, so great. And then some sage as well, which is super healthy. Some beautiful rosemary as well. I also like to add a little bit of water to this as well. And for me, what makes this dish also is I love to switch it up and add things to the top. I know most people do their zucchini noodles just with the sauce, but to me, these four ingredients add the perfect flavor with this. So I add a little bit of red pepper, and then I also add some pineapple, which goes great with the curry. I add some red onion as well, and then some cherry tomatoes on top. Here we have our beautiful raw zucchini pasta dish. I can't recommend this enough. It has so much flavor and the fruit and vegetables on top really make the dish in my opinion. So I hope you do give this a try. If you think it will, give this video a thumbs up right now. Subscribe to my channel for more videos like this one and I will see you next time. Bye.